Good morning, it's Du Daniels here with your morning news wrap up. I'm just kidding. What I wanted to do was look at this clip. It says calcium and vitamin D pills. Let me draw on that real quick. Vitamin D pills. Okay, I want that to be the main word everybody remembers going forward. But calcium and vitamin D pills don't prevent fractures. A panel says, we don't know who the panel is, but that's what they say. Now, this is important because everybody links vitamin D and calcium to strengthening bones. So if, if these pills are not going to help you prevent fractures, then why in God's earth do people take calcium pills? Well, the reality is they shouldn't. Um, you can read this article. It's on latimes.com. Um, or if you just look in your Google uh, panel, you'll see it. But there, you know, my thing is this is not this is not weird to me. Pills. If you're taking calcium pills, I've been telling friends this for years that calcium pills are not going to be uh, worth anything to you. You're probably going to absorb 10 percent of it or less when you're looking at calcium capsules perhaps you will get a better ratio and then when it comes to calcium i just wrote an article uh on let's go to this website i just wrote an article on my website and um, the article was on um how periodontal disease or gingivitis if you go to longevityproducts.org you'll see the recent article put on there about gingivitis is really bone loss in your jaw so when you have you know receding gums that's what you're really dealing with and you are not getting all of the required calcium that you need you're just not getting all of the calcium uh, that you need and then also when it comes to calcium and vitamin d you need it at a certain ratio this is what a lot of doctors nutritionists um they won't tell you is that you need these at a certain ratio so that it absorbs in your body better so i agree with this article i agree with this panel that calcium and vitamin d pills don't prevent fractures and if you take a liquid multivitamin um like the one found on this website that this is right here it's called the osteo fx plus it's a product from Longevity that Dr. Wallet put together. And this product will help you strengthen your bones and strengthen bone loss and anything like that. It's liquid, so it's 98% absorbable. So you're getting the calcium at the right ratios. You know, for you know, 2,000 milligrams of calcium, you're going to get 1,000 uh, milligrams of magnesium, which is the right ratio. And then a third of that will be phosphorus, which is the right building blocks for bones. Now, if not, then you're going to continue to waste precious money. And people like this are going to be able to write articles um, talking about how calcium pills and calcium uh, vitamin D uh, pills don't prevent fractures, don't strengthen bone, don't do any of that. So be careful with these headlines. Um, these cats, these uh, media people know what they're trying to do. I wouldn't take calcium pills at all. I don't care if it says, you know, 3,000 milligrams. Cause you're, you have to take a lot of those just to get it absorbed because you, it, with pills, you're only absorbing about 10% or less. So, therefore, you won't see an, any difference unless you're taking a boatload of the pills. You might as well get some nice pineapple juice, orange juice, and Put the liquid calcium into your orange juice, pineapple juice. Drink it down once or twice a day. Know for sure you're getting the right amounts of calcium and uh, minerals that you need for the day. So, just wanted to make this video so that everybody's aware of that because I see news publications like this and they literally drive me crazy. So, do Daniel signing off. Peace and blessings. I'll see y'all next time.